Pre-oxygenate the patient. Lubricate the tube. Grasp the patient's tongue and jaw with your gloved hand and pull forward. Gently insert the tube until the teeth are between the printed rings. Inflate line 1, the blue pilot balloon, leading to the pharyngeal cuff with 100 cc of air. Inflate line 2, the white pilot balloon, leading to the distal cuff with 15 cc of air. Ventilate the patient through the longer blue tube. Auscultate for breath sounds and sounds over the epigastrium. Look for the chest to rise and fall. If breath sounds are positive and epigastric sounds are negative, continue ventilation through the blue tube. The tube is in the esophagus. In the esophageal mode, stomach contents can be aspirated through the number 2 or white tube, relieving gastric distension. If breath sounds are negative and epigastric sounds are positive, attempt ventilation through the shorter number 2 white tube and reassess for lung and epigastric sounds. If breath sounds are present and the chest rises, you have intubated the trachea and continue ventilation through the shorter tube. Tape to secure or use a commercial tube holder. Confirm tube placement using end tidal CO2 detector or esophageal bulb device. It is strongly recommended that the airway, if equipment is available, be monitored continuously through capnography and pulse oximetry. It is strongly recommended that an airway evaluation form be completed with any BAD use.